Well, everyone, as we all know, this is a very different kind of Christmas Eve, and it'll be a different type of Christmas Day as well, because as we all know, given everything, and I mean, and the radio have said it, the TV have said it, and politicians, and everyone said it, I think we're sick of hearing the phrase by now. By now, and I promise I only say it the once, is that Christmas will be different this year, and yeah, it will be different, but we all know hopefully by next year, things will be back to normal. As I've said, this is, feels like a very different Christmas Eve, because, um, we can't go out to the pubs for a few drinks. We um can't go. We um sorry. What was I going to say again? Sorry, mind fluff. Um, we can't uh, gather at houses and meet up. We can't gather and fa gather with our families and have a few songs over the piano and a few drinks on Christmas Eve, like um as my family normally do. And yeah, I'm sad that we can't all do that this year. But I mean, we all just have to play it safe, tread the waters carefully, and hopefully, and without doubt, well, hopefully, everything by next Christmas will be back to normal, and we'll all be. And for all of us, for Strava folk, we'll all be up in Henry Cavanagh's again, having a nice pint of Guinness. And even this is a bit of a different Christmas for me, because I can't really go out that much anymore, because given um, my health over the last couple of um, weeks, um, I have to stay safe as well. I can go out, like, for a walk and now and again, which is good, as long as I wrap up warmly, in my in all nice coats and layers and scarves, and of course, I'll wear my nice Santa hat. Of course, it is, after all, it is Christmas. And um, I can't really, I can't really do any visiting or anything, or no one can really visit me. It's just window visits because of my have to look after my health. I know, yeah. And um, actually, on the subject of that, um, I just want to thank everyone, friends and family, for all your support and your prayers and your kind messages. It just, um, it means so much. Uh, so just thank you again for all the lovely messages and the prayers and thoughts and all. It's, it's been so strengthening for me. It's really helped me get through all this and um, I start my next batch of treatment in on in the new year on the 4th of January so I'm just delighted beyond delighted to be home for Christmas I'm just so happy because I just don't think I would have coped if I had to spend it in hospital like I just it was been it would have been like I know it would have been for my health but it would have been miserable so I'm just glad to be home and even if it is through a window I'm just glad to see my family like my cousins and all it was just great to see them um so um I don't want to go on too long, I uh, don't want to bang on on too much, much, because I'm sure you're all probably watching, you probably want to get back to watching your Christmas movies and having a bit of eggnog and, and a bit of wine and anything. So I'll just wrap this video up uh, quickly and say I just want to wish everyone a very happy Christmas and uh, can we say a happy new year? Um, I'm not sure, can we really say happy new year? Can we say that? Well, actually, do you know what? Um, I want to wish you all a very happy Christmas and a very prosperous, loving new year. I think that's the everything to say. So, um, happy Christmas and a very prosperous new year. Bye!